It's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Taurus. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of January 4th through January 10th. Uh, keep in mind the timing is still fluid, and not every reading is for you, okay? So what do we have for Taurus for January 4th through the 10th? What do we have for Taurus? Overall energy, please. Star. So wish is going to be granted. You asked for something. You prayed for something. Your wish is being granted. So this is wish fulfillment, right? Every time I get a candle, the camera doesn't focus in. Guess we'll leave it there, huh? It's about as good as it gets. It is about as good as it gets. This is a dream come true. You prayed for this. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Let's get a couple of these. It's yours. Whatever it is, it's yours. Your prayers have been answered. I think we'll take just one. It's time to get back to the basics. You're protected. This is a new purpose. This is renewal. This is guaranteed success. It's like, the, you know, when I see the star card, I think, I think of the very fairy godmother that has granted your wish. Mm. Queen of Swords. Now this is a professional. You could be dealing with a professional this week. Somebody that is, I don't know, you could be signing something. Uh, there's some sort of communication coming through, truthful, factual information. Um, be authentic. Be yourself. New pers new perspective. You may be gaining some sort of new perspective. Somebody may be helping you as well. You could be dealing with a professional that is helping you to reach your goals or fulfill your dreams. Somebody that is, you know, in a professional position. Um, you're going to be receiving some sort of information that is the answer to your prayers, put it that way, from an individual that is very honest, authentic, truthful. You be, may be making a very logical decision this week as well. You may need to think fast as well because the Queen of Swords sometimes has to think on her feet, has to think fast. You may get a wish granted that, you know, opens your eyes to something that you hadn't considered. Four of Wands reversed. Seven of Swords reversed. Three of Swords, there's going to be some heartache in the past. The heartache is in the past. You're leaving the heartache in the past. You're leaving the pain in the past. There could be an old engagement or an old marriage or an old foundation that you are leaving in the past. This is an escape. The Seven of Swords, it's some sort of escape. You're letting go of something. You're taking a new approach. Maybe an old foundation, you know, you may be leaving an old foundation behind, an old marriage, an old contract, something like that. Or it's a contract that you have been in, some sort of partnership perhaps. So this could even have to do with a home with the Four of Wands. This is leaving it behind.
Oops. Three of Wands, get prepared for something. Now, this 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 Seven of Swords reverse can be getting caught doing something. Somebody could be getting caught doing something. We could have some deception here. This is also jumping ship. You may be jumping shipped. Ship, ship, ship. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> That four of wands is not happy though. It's unhappiness. Somebody's not happy. You could be dealing with somebody that's not happy. Maybe they're not happy. Maybe you're jumping ship. I don't know. Maybe you're making a getaway. The seven of swords reverse. This is get prepared for some sort of arrival or some. It could be an arrival or a departure. Somebody could be arriving. Somebody could be leaving. This is wishing and hoping for the best. So hoping for the best. And there's hope here. You may be getting some sort of information that makes you very happy. This is something that you asked for. It may have something to do with an engagement or a new foundation or something. And it feels like uh, you've been waiting for this. You've been waiting for it for a long time. But there may be somebody that is in the past that is hurting. This is hurt. This is pain. What is this Three of Swords? Yeah, unfinished business from the past. There's somebody that may try to stop you for some reason. They may try to stop you from doing something. The world card reverse is a lack of success. Flogging a dead horse. This is some, but this is a stuck in the past. Some, but you're leaving the past behind. Because this is, I go from past, present, future. So presently, you are making a decision. You're making a logical decision presently. Your wish is being granted this week. But there's probably somebody that's not going to be happy with your decision. You're making some sort of logical decision that is best for you. Okay? It's a dream come true. But I feel like there is somebody in the past that is hurting. They're in some sort of pain. And you're leaving the pain and suffering behind. Now this is, this, this is, uh, the world card is about clinging to the past. You may have been clinging to the past for some time. Okay, you may have been flogging a dead horse for a long time. Okay, you may have been hurting over lack of closure or hurting over some unfinished business. But now the Queen of Swords is somebody who puts herself first, her or him. I'm going to put myself first. It's all about me. Okay, I do feel like there is a new perspective that is being gained. I feel like you are getting some sort of information. And I feel it, whatever this information, and I think you're taking a new approach. I feel like you are, um, I don't know, you're escaping some sort of unhappy situation because this wish, whatever this wish is, 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 is wish fulfillment. It's a, it's a wish being granted in your favor. Something is going to go in your favor. It could have to do with, I don't know if it's a legal contract or something like that. Something is going to go in your favor. Um, I think that you have absolutely been waiting for this. Okay, but there's definitely somebody behind you that is probably they may they may want to stop you with the world reversed. Um, clinging to something has not brought you success. It's only caused you a lot of pain. It's time to be logical. Okay, and I think that you've gained some sort of new perspective, or you you're in that place right now of clarity. You see very clearly what you need to do. Temperance. This is a card of timing. This is a journey. This is the journey of life. Accepting and allowing that change is is here. Okay. This is a change. You are, and this is an exchange. It's exchanging something that wasn't successful for something better. So you you are you are going through a big time of evolution right now. You are. You're, this is a card of patience. You've been waiting because the three of wands is waiting. You've been waiting for this wish to be fulfilled. You've prayed. You know. You've said your prayers. You've had faith because the star is a card of faith. And it's like your wish is, is being granted. Now it's time. It's time. This is a card of timing. It's time for you to get what you asked for. Um, I feel like it's going to be a very intense week. You may have been uh, planning something as well. We 
you definitely have a change and this is a card of purpose and this is a card of purpose as well so all this all this pain that you have suffered it happened for a reason it made you wiser okay it changed your look on life it may have made you a little bit hard okay it may have may, may have made you a little bit hard and cold unfortunately but everything happens for a reason you know it's at least you're not naive there's no naivety here so anyway um this is a path you're going down a new path this is the journey of life after death okay temperance comes after death so obviously something is ending and you are you're taking a journey you're going down that path to something better you've learned some sort of lesson you have through the heartache and the pain that you have suffered so that four of wands i think that there's the you know, there's been a lack of joy. There's been a lack of happiness and you've been waiting and wishing and praying for something to arrive and here it is. You've evolved. This pain has evolved you, okay? Three of Pentacles reversed. Now we got these threes. Three, 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 threes. Your prayers have been heard. Your prayers have been heard. Three, three, three. I love to see that. Three, three, three. I saw it the other day and I was shocked. I actually got a new license plate in it. They handed it to me and it was said three, three, three. And I was like, wow. My prayers have been answered. Thank you, Lord. So, yeah. Three, three, three. I feel like you have been dealing with somebody that you are not on the same page with. You lack harmony with this person. There's real, really no commitment there. There could have been deception. There could be deceiving. There could be cheating. There could be lying. Okay? Somebody could be lying. They could have been cheating. They could have been doing something behind your back. Um, I have to say that because of the... Because of the uh, the Seven of Swords reversed and the Three of Pentacles reversed. There's a lack of respect. You could be dealing with somebody that is very sneaky, very shady, that doesn't respect you. Okay? Um, they could be cheating. And I hate to say And cheating doesn't have to be sexual. Cheating could be in any other way. Cheating you in some way. It could be stealing. Okay? With money. Okay? With the Three of Pentacles. There could be some thieving going on or something like that. Um, but I think that you should... Uh, get ready get ready for some sort of change okay and this is a big change and i think it's going to make you extremely happy because the four of wands reverse can be extreme so it could make you extremely extremely happy you could you something is arriving that could that could make you extremely happy you may not have expected it you know you've been waiting for it you've been praying for it and it's surreal this is this is surreal. This is this is something better than you even wished for, right? Um, it's definitely a big, major life change. Whatever it is with that Temperance card, your hard work and your patience has paid off. Evolution. Your life is changing. The worst is over. The worst is over. The pain and the suffering that you've been through is over. I think that you've been hanging on to something that really, really hurt you. But now there's a new idea, right? There's taking a new approach. Because this wish gets granted, you you receive something, you know, you, you start this new life and it's even better than the other one. Everything happens for a reason. This may have gotten you prepared for this new life. The heartache and the suffering and the pain may have gotten you prepared for what is coming. You should be getting prepared right now. If you are not prepared, there is something coming that you prayed for. Put it that way. Press. This is the birth of a new life. 
This is absolutely the birth of a new life. You have suffered. You've already experienced the pain. It's time for you to receive a blessing. So you are going to be starting a new life. Some of you may be getting pregnant you, or you are going to give birth or you're just in that energy of birthing a new life. And it's after the pain. This is the pain. This is the beginning. Okay? So I feel like you are going to be getting some very, very, very happy news. Um, this is this is everything that you ever asked for. This is a miracle. Some of you um, could be getting married. Okay? Um, you could be getting a new home. Um, you may be getting engaged. Um, you could be... Uh, somebody could be arriving that you did not expect to arrive. Okay, this could be an arrival. And we got the Knight of Swords on the bottom. This is a hero. Okay, this is a hero coming to save the day. If that's what you're looking for. I mean, that's not what, every, that's not what I'm looking for. But if that's what you're looking for, I mean, but it could be unexpected. And, you know, you may not even want to have anything to do with it. But some of you do. But anyhow, um, this, is, this is somebody arriving. This is somebody rushing in rushing in to save the day and it doesn't have to be a lover it doesn't have to be a lover but this is somebody that is coming to break you free from some sort of situation that you have been tied to you have been tied to a situation and you are about to be cut free so this is really 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 good okay this is a this is uh having plenty the empress is having plenty very abundant wealthy um if you are a masculine watching this and you have been praying for love, the Empress is tender, love, and care. Tender, love, and care. This is somebody who does everything with love. Very abundant, very wealthy. Um, it doesn't have to be wealthy, wealthy. But this person is rich. Rich um, with more than just money. Okay, this person is the whole package. So it could be dealing with a, another Taurus or a Libra, but it could be could be any sign. Um Get prepared for an arrival of some sort. Because this is get prepared and this is a delivery. Okay? Get prepared for a new life. This is something that you asked for. It's time. It's definitely time. It's time for you to receive the blessing. Okay? So you're, gonna, you're getting a blessing. This is a blessing. This is a blessing. And this is a blessing. Blessing, blessing, blessing. So you are about to be blessed this week with something that... You have been waiting for. This is where you've been waiting. And you it feels like you uh, have not been on the same page with others. You've been cheated, right? Or, you've, or you're, you're feeling deceived or something. But I have to tell you that your prayers have been heard. There's nothing to worry about. Your faith. Your faith. Because the star card is about faith. Your faith in humanity. Your faith in a higher power is what is bringing in this blessing. So you are be definitely about to be blessed. We have a beautiful person here that is about to receive the help. Good luck. 